I be that young rapping dude Might just trap with you Coming with the thunder baby Might just snap it through I roll out in the morning light Whip that Harley bike All black, I'm the party type And it's dark tonight I just stepped in no weapon But my outfit might take the soul See my presence impressive Got strippers slipping off the poles I just whip, then I swerve them Wish you would, I'm Timmy Turner Turned her to a carnivore Now she treat me like a burger Yo, what's up guys, Darkbreaker here and for today's video we are playing Yina on the newest patch. You heard it right, Yina got finally changed and I think the changes are pretty good. So let me open the website really quick. It's just really, they just changed the passive so that the silence got nerfed, the slow got nerfed and the damage of the silence got nerfed but they added an additional shield whenever you proc your passive so let's talk about the exact numbers really quick okay the silence and slow duration got nerfed from 1 second to 0.75 seconds okay the damage bonus got nerfed from 2 AD to 1.5 AD and new added a shield of 200 plus 100 per skill level so 400 total max level plus 1.0 AD so what did change exactly because of this the bush camping traps the potential of bush trapping got nerfed and the build for Yina actually got nerfed as well. If you go for my standard build, which was Spear of Longinus into Shield of the Lost and then Omni Arms, and then you will lack damage early slash mid game. So instead I changed the build a little bit because you will get a shield when you proc your passive anyway, so that's kind of helpful. And in the late game it will be more than 1.4k shield anyway so that's actually a pretty solid shield so the more ad you have the more shield you're getting whenever you proc your passive so that's really useful and that's why we changed the build just a little bit like the item build pathing path got changed just a little bit so you will have still enough damage to one shot people because i noticed with the old build you will have a lot less damage because of the passive nerf so you have to build more aggressive and more ad so for the build we're actually going for spear of longinus because rank breaker got nerfed and spear of longinus 15 percent cooldown reduction is still really useful and as yina you can proc the five stacks no, four stacks actually four stacks really easily then knight's plate then omni arms then fenrir so heavy damage focus build immediately Okay, right here we're griefing. I didn't expect them to be four people here. I was like, maybe two or three people, I can beat them. But yeah, kind of too greedy. Anyways, and then after Fenrir, we finish Knight's Plate into Sheet of the Lost. And then for the last item, we either go for Blade of Eternity or Troy for Magic Resistance. So, actually... I thought the Yina nerf would be more significant or the changes would be first at the first moment I was like wow this is such a huge buff if she gets shield that it will make her more useful in team fights and so on and it's actually a good change so she doesn't one shot people anymore but honestly nothing nothing really changed like when I play Yina I'm still absolutely smurfing right now in most of my games Actually, in every game so far, I'm literally smurfing on Yina. And she's still just so strong. So, not really nerfed, in my opinion. Still really good. Okay, we are roaming, but Enzo's actually... Enzo's 07, right? Yeah, it's 07. Since we're playing with 07. Okay, let's kill this guy. Actually, I didn't use my S2 right here because I was like, I don't want to steal his mega kill. I was like, okay, let's let's give him the mega kill, don't keep attacking, but I should have just attacked. 
because you see he escaped because i didn't use my s2 immediately i was like okay let's try to give give it to him okay let's take the red buff and he might be in the bush he's actually not just poke him he dashes out it's fine let's just clear the wave then okay what can we do right now maybe we can just attack him he's kind of overextended too far out okay i can't reach him okay no oh he flickered as well that was actually really good for him that he flickered out of my range for the okay not bad but we still managed to kill him it's fine yeah but still pretty good flicker reaction otherwise he would have just died from the s1 immediately and then i don't know why he decided to keep staying because i was almost full life while he was low life even i was like even if you hit the ultimate onto me there is no way you can kill me and no way you will win this I don't even know who this guy is. He's like at me. Okay, baby. Maybe. Maybe if you play well, I will at you. <laughs> Easy. Okay, can we kill this guy as well? Okay, we got this. Let's just go on to... You see, we, the burst damage is still pretty good if you go for this build. And that's the thing. If you go for this build, it's a high risk, high rewarding build. So that's a good change what they did. Before you could go for the tanky build and still one shot people without a problem. But now you have to decide, okay, do I want to play more tanky or do I play offensively? Then I'm really squishy. I can get killed really quick, but I still have the one shot potential. So for the changes, I decided to go for the more high risk, high reward build. It's more fun. So... Actually, it's a pretty pretty good change what they did for Yina. She's still pretty good, but she also can't go for the super tanky build, which still one-shots people. So it's a good change what they did for Yina. Good adjustment. She's still good, but not as OP, I would say. The shield is still really good, of course. The shield they added, is, it's pretty good. But yeah, the tank, the semi-tanky build which I was using before was just so strong. Like there was no chance to, if I don't play against Richter, there was like no chance to win in the lane. No, I mean, you can still win in the lane of course with Omen or something like that. But most of the times people don't know how to play other side laners besides Richter. So when I play Yina it was still pretty easy. Yeah, we can still take red buff after this. This, uh, this is going to be super risky because everyone is coming already. Okay. We still managed to get it. It's fine, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, Batman is here somewhere. Let's see if we can trap. Okay, Batman is engaging actually. Yeah, I will get Arrow Ultimate. That and that was obvious. Eat my S1. Boom. Oh, she got the kill. Fits Batman. Let's take the mid tower. The others are pushing T3. It's fine. I actually fucked up the combo a little bit, but we still get the kill, it's fine. Okay, now we have Fenrir, now we are super strong. But we don't have Flicker for the S1 Flicker place anymore, feels, feels bad, man. 
I guess we could just go for Slayer and then finish the game. Okay, that's nice. Let's go. W with the Slayer buff, we should be able to finish it. Can we reach the others? Oh, wow. Yeah, you can see how squishy I am. Just a little bit of magic poke damage. And we're super low life. Wow. Okay, they're fighting. Let's see if we can... Okay, there's Arum. Yeah, because of Arum, I... Because of Arum, I have to play so carefully that I don't get engaged on and she just used ultimate on me and I will just die for free. So I have to play really careful or otherwise I will just get fucked by Arum. Ooh. There's one. Oh boy, you can see this. Yeah, I got the kill. <laughs> Goodbye and so fit Batman. Okay, I got the kill on to Chi as well. No other questions. We are really low life, so I don't think we can keep fighting here. We should probably just go back. Or I will go for mini dragon. And that might be enough for me to heal up again. And we have enhanced restore. I, yeah, I probably don't even have to go back. Let's use enhanced restore right now. And see if we can trap somewhere. Hello guys! Hello, hello! Batman, you want to come for farming? Okay, never mind, they're fighting there, so let's chase. Okay, can't really reach any one of them. Why does she always ultimate on me? Why would you always ultimate on me? Come on, come on girl. What's your problem? I don't do anything to you. Oh yeah, the Kali damage just... We couldn't um, move out of it anymore because we just came out of the Teamy ultimate. Why would you target me? Target Enzo, target ADC or something. Why me? Anyways, I think that's pretty much game. I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay of us. Okay, are they finishing or not? Lower this higher tier, okay, not bad, not bad. The randoms didn't play bad at all, they played pretty good. Okay, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay of us playing Yina on the newest patch. If so, then please leave a like, subscribe, activate the notification bell, and write down below in the comments for which heroes you'd like to see more content like this. So I wish you a nice time, nice day, and i see you next time. Bye-bye.